John and uh, John and Colleen and uh, yes. well, who, you know what? Everybody come yeah, up. Yeah, right, right up there. Let's go. Everybody come up. Oh, what is happening? Oh, the slip. energy in this room. Grab a slip. Uh, Grab a slip. Grab here's a slip. what's gonna happen. Get a slip. Here we go. Get I a slip. Mine. Which side? Which we, side? Left side. Left side. Left side. We now we would one. really love. Uh, we're going to perform. <laughs> We're going to perform a scene for you now uh, that's unlike any other you've ever seen before. Brand and here's, here's why, because uh, we're improvising it. <laughs> it's not written. You will have never seen it before. Um, so what's going to happen is uh, these four fantastic actors are going to be in so inspired um, by what they have uh, on this, these pieces of paper in front of them that they are going to stand and they are going to tell us why they deserve to be the next presidential candidate yes. of these United States as these characters there, there will be no debating, just a real pitch. So I want to hear you guys tell me why you will be the next presidential candidate. And begin. <clears throat> I'll start. My name is Tamaka, and I'm a level two. I'm from Morgantown, uh, uh, WV, that's West Virginia. I know that because I want to be president, OK? Uh, I'm like a, my name is like a Tonka truck, but I pronounce it Tamanka. And uh, here's the deal. Coffee makes me think of wild bears. And uh, my microphone fell out because I got so excited about these wild bears being in my personal presidential cabinet that I think you should put, put me in the Oval Office America, and I will scrapbook the heck out of this country. Thank you. My name is Joey. I'm a level five from Sioux City, Iowa. And while I certainly appreciate wild bears, I have to say that I certainly much more appreciate stuffed bears. Because I like to drink coffee with my stuffed animals. <laughs> Why would I make a good president? I'll tell you this. When you're sleeping at home at night, what would you like next year? A loved one, sure. Peace, the courage to sleep through the night, definitely. <laughs> but more than that, Critter after critter after critter after critter. Not alive, but dead and stuffed. Sitting there with you, keeping you safe through the night. If I become president, I will guarantee everyone at least five stuffed animals and six throw pillows for every home in America. That's a promise from Joey. Hello, my name is Suzanne. I'm a level two from Seiko ME. If I wasn't so tired right now, I would remember what Emmy stood for. Maine! Maine! <laughs> but I also like the fact that it's Emmy and it means me. <laughs> I like to think I'm from me, my own self. I have the courage to, when drink coffee, think of home. And I'd like that home to turn from this sensible two bedroom I live in to the White House, which I imagine has more than two bedrooms, including the Lincoln. My hobbies, surfing. Could you imagine trouble coming and your president of the United States tacking it? with a surfboard? That could be me. <laughs> but I like to drink coffee with hot water, which just makes good common sense. Because if you drank it with cold water, it'd be a cold coffee. And that's just not American. <laughs> My name is Terry. I'm from Centerville, Ohio. I'm a level five. And uh, I like happy smells, America. Smells that are happy. I don't like sad smells or the smells of defeat, America. I like smells that lift me up like maple syrup. Maple syrup lifts me up and lifts up this country. So do milk and friends. <laughs> Which are some of my other hobbies, America. I love my friends, I love my nation, and I love a good glass of vitamin D milk. Woo! Yeah. Yeah. 